Okay, hello and welcome to this uh, quick video on sort of a PHP kind of tip um, efficiency thing this one is. Um, so the idea here is that um, basically this is what you don't want to do. Uh, if you need to check two conditions and you want them to sort of both be true, um, if you do like a slow check first and then a fast one second, if the slow one returns false the fast one won't be run. Um, by a slow check by the way I mean like something that will go to a database instead of just checking if something is set. So say if you had like is set username or is set session something or other um, sort of and validate username or something like that you know that go to a database does a bit more work and it should be fairly obvious because like a quick is set line is obviously shorter than a user defined custom function which does a database check. That's obviously going to be slower isn't it than this set check. So. And the idea is that instead of doing the slow check first, because if this returns false, PHP won't bother with this second check, it'll just move on because this condition is already invalid. Um, so if, uh, what am I saying, if um, the slow check fails, PHP won't do the fast check. But what instead you should do is the fast check first. So I just cut that and paste it there. So now, with this the other way around, PHP will do this uh, fast check first. If that passes, it'll move on and do the slow check. And then if that also passes, it'll run this block. But if the fast check fails, it'll just sort of give up and move on to down here. Because uh, if this returns false, the check, the condition, the whole thing is already invalid. Um, so yeah, generally, sort of rule of thumb is do whichever check is going to be quicker. You don't have to actually work it out if they're fairly similar. Don't bother like timing them. Just, uh, just, just guess. <laughs> um, yeah, generally, uh, faster checks or what you think will be a quicker code to run should go on the left. Um, this also applies if you're using or instead of and. So say if you wanted either of these to be true. You would also want the fast check on the left because PHP goes left to right. Um, so it would do this check first. If this were to return true, um, sorry, if this were to return true, it would just run the block straight away because th this or this has to be true. It wouldn't actually do this check if this was true. This was true. Um, uh, but if this first check returned false, it would move on, do this next check. Um, and if that returned false, it would just give up and move to down here. Um, or if it was true, it'd run the block. This block here. Um, that's, what, that's what I put in there. Uh, yeah. So, what am I saying? I am saying about this. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, if this, were the, if this were the other way around, it'd do the slow check first. Um, and that's not what you want, because there's a potential to skip the slow check by doing the fast check first. Um, I probably shouldn't have used these two functions, fast and slow. Just obviously these don't exist. Um, I just wanted to demonstrate, and this seemed like a simple way to do that. So yeah, the tip is, whichever check you think will be faster, put that on the left. Okay, so thanks for watching this, and hopefully it was fairly useful.